Um, but yeah, that's it. So I thought next we would talk about something that was played a very important part. Um, I think maybe you would look up, uh, you should, yeah, the sport shirt, the vintage sport shirt. Um, sport I thought we'd shirt. talk about one big component about why this is not that one. There you go. Uh, <laughs> about why uh, the, I think the outfit was successful. And it's the rayon shirt, man. Yeah. It's uh, so my Aloha shirts are all made of rayon. Um, the one I have is like more of like a silky rayon. It's not like a rayon gabardine. But like you know, you have these shirts, and honestly, you could wear this anywhere. I I to me, uh, since uh, you know, I'm not really going anywhere in the summer. I typically wear like a tie during the day. Um, these have been like my going out shirts, and. I you know I love them. I think MJ, you have you have do you have a camp? Yeah, you have like the yellow one, right? Yeah, yeah. And so you know you have these uh, these shirts that are like every okay. The thing is, I think everyone sees this this, this shirt collar and goes, yeah, that's that, that's like a vacation shirt. The people all I think people already know that this is like a casual shirt. Yeah, you know, yeah. it's a great and, shirt. And then because most people's first exposure, or at least my experiences, are. The Hawaiian shirts are the Aloha shirts. So yeah, I think it's nowadays the like, uh, form of that. Can you can you guys uh, talk about Aloha shirts for a minute? Sure. Log on to some. Okay, log on to what? Uh, but yeah, I think Aloha shirts are like a really good example of it because it's yeah, most people see it that way. Um, but I th- also think that. Um, you see a lot more camp collar shirt, like in general. So camp collar, it's got that mm-hmm. that sport collar. You know, it's the uh, there's no collar band; it just lays flat, as you see on the guy in the left there. Yeah. Um, and um, it just looks it just looks casual. I mean, that's what it was back then. It was sportswear. Yeah. It was it was like the designated casual shirt. Like you wore the shirt with the with the collar band for the tie. For the business, and then when you're off work or the weekend, you would wear these shirts. You just take it and off that's... and leave it open. Yeah, exactly. Um, and so, like, yeah, that's what these. That's why these are so great. And when you find them today, right? They, they. I always say get them in rayon, but you can find them in cotton or linen or whatever. But like, it's like the best. It's like the best shirt. It's yeah. you know, it's you don't need to wear a tie with it, um, because you. You can't. It's not really. Um, but you can wear them across like a lot of like you can wear them with a sport coat, you can wear them with like a chore jacket, you can wear it by itself. And I don't know, like it's it's vintage enough to or it's it's interesting enough to look vintage to look like it's not just like a business shirt. Like yeah. you don't look business casual wearing it, you know. Right. Yeah, it's like it's enough to be like more dressed up than a t-shirt. Um, yes, but not like not like a regular collared shirt. It's mm-hmm. a you know as far as collared shirts go, um, without ties, it's uh, you know it's it leans more on the casual side. But I feel like today's context, you're already um, quote unquote more dressed up. <laughs> well, yeah, more I mean because dr- it's like more dressed up but less. You know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's one of those things where, like, I think now that it's like a fashion piece, mm-hmm. it's not dressed up, but like, oh, it's you're you're trying a little bit, you know, yeah. like look at like you know, this is that's like you know all those TikToks and those YouTubers like, oh yeah, get a cam collar shirt because it's like, you know, it's it's not a t-shirt and it's not like a short sleeve regular button down collar shirt, like it's it's like regular. Um, I mean, there's a lot of different variations of it, but one particular thing that that's really good is that it's made of rayon, which is uh, it's a synthetic fabric made of tree pulp, so it's technically organic. And uh, I know Spencer's scrolling through um, yeah. with these different color types here. But it was, like the I mean, yeah. Color. So ray, it, it was like a very, very early like silk alternative. Yeah, yes. and so it's woven like, mm-hmm. and so most of the time it's woven uh, in a twill, which is gabardine. Um, and that's how you get like a really like heft, like you can see it in the pictures, like it's got heft to it. Yeah. You see by the wrinkling and the drape there, um, that it's, it's really cool. And so, you know, you have a lot of these in like, the, like, um, like bowling shirts, people have them, work shirts, casual plain shirts, plaid shirts, stuff like that. Oh man, Aloha look at these. Shirts, yeah. Look at the patterns on these. Yeah. 
really like you don't make them like that anymore mm -hmm. um and so these shirts are like super versatile because you know it's like to me um uh early on with like slp you know they would wear like unbuttoned silk shirts but with like regular collars and i'm like well you know sports shirts kind of look the same way you know so it's like okay well, i already started collecting them uh to be vintage casual if, like that like you know the looks here like bad looks with like gray trousers and everything like that but i'm like oh if i wore this with like black slim jeans and, like a leather jacket it affects the same slp look that i really want and so yeah if you have them it's like the it's like the, yeah the perfect shirt look right um, here nothing more masculine <laughs> So there you go. If you're trying to look well, that's crazy. I mean, this one's not. This one's not rayon. This is fucking tropical. Oxford, Oxford yeah. cloth on fancy weave shirt. This thing. Is yeah, this crazy, looks like bro. 30s or like early 40s. So this is like an older one. Mm hmm But yeah, I love got... these right here. I mean, check out Mel Magazine whenever his article is being published for yeah. something that we took part in uh, about yeah. rayon shirts. Yeah, look at these. I mean, this is how they wear them. By they, I mean mm -hmm. vintage. <laughs> vintage people. <laughs> oh, man. Look at that one. Yellow. It's so good, dude. That one. This is great. I well, love the that sandals. Looks like something that, yeah, I would say that, that one looks like what a guy would wear today with, like, five-inch and seam shorts. That's right. Yeah. But I like that, hey, it has a really great collar on it. Yeah, like a long Italian collar. I like how yeah, there's beautiful. no people in the background. Yeah. Oh, is there? Oh, there's, <laughs> there's, there's a bunch of on there. Yeah, and he's That's just like, cool. "Hey, what's up?" Those guys look weird. They're like drawn. <laughs> yeah, it's like, what the fuck is with these guys? Oh, here I we don't go. Know why this one's here because that the short sleeve. Uh, both right of these, shirt. yeah, both of these are like not sports shirts Whoop. technically. Whoop, my bad. 2017, Ethan, go to hell. Um, Apparently. nice colors. This one's cool. Uh, also, maybe not technically sport shirt. Yeah, I can't tell with that one because it's like kind of like curling up on the on like the collar band area. Yeah, that's cool, man. Yeah, oh, look hey. at those collars. Look at those pockets, man. How about the dude? How about the pleats on those pants, man? Those are. Those so are... Bring those pockets back, man. Bring yeah, yeah the low like they're lower on the body too. Dude, that like um, that thing's great. They're about to like just double team that lady. <laughs> Can we say that? I feel. I mean, we're not passing judgment. I feel like we're allowed to say it, right? We're very. We're a sex positive podcast. Call uh, yeah, this is right? Yeah. Yeah. Um. Those are cool. There oh. we go, man. That's what I'm yeah, talking that's, about. Uh, that's a long one. Love oh, remember, that photo. Yeah, was, yeah, the photo of like the western shirts. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, look how this one. The like for me, the draw was the sport shirts, and then I <laughs> now it's like whoa. Where it's, now it's a western sawtooth on the left there and the western suit on the right yeah there you go you classic the flannel suit. yeah i mean you can yeah. still get like the plaid ones from like pendleton is still selling these mm -hmm. um this is a great photo Iconic. yeah yeah this is sick hey there's Women a too, man that's oh. also not a sport shirt but it's a rayon western shirt yeah and then oh, god boy. 2017 <laughs> okay uh, that, that and that is there for I, I am critiquing it in that first in that first uh yeah it's job, like supposed right? to be a bad example that's okay i probably wouldn't wear it but if i was working at j crew and saw that i'd be See, like I hey think, this is pretty good the thing is the thing with this is like you know i think people have seen i mean this is also like written like two almost three years ago but like people see these shirts so when you wear a shirt that's similar to it people will get it you know yeah what I mean? exactly like, like Oh yeah, there it is. Like yeah, you wear this long like Bengal stripe or mm -hmm. awning stripe one. There's you know? the SLP thing that you're but it's talking like, yeah, about. If you, yeah, but it's like you could do this like you know maybe like get a wider jean, but then you see like yeah the fun prints are so like uh yeah this is the repro no, absolutely one, but, like, yeah. Hey, I own that shirt. There's there's the love, uh, the Bryson's guys. Ones. That one's great. Yeah, that one's yeah. Cool. Look at Kenji. Look at Kenji. Go back up. Look at that, dude. That's perfect part. Like, like, yeah. Clearly, he's at a party. Like, yeah. he's at a he's at a party right there. Got the long chain. Um, <laughs> love yeah, that. Long, the yeah, long, yeah, long chain. Love. Check out, check out. Also, like his cuff over his jacket cuff. That's cool. Like that's a kind of a baller move, right? But like, look at him severely unbuttoned. Love like the the print like that. See, like this is like, like I know people. Like obviously, he's in the industry. He's not like a quote normal dude, but like 
like in terms of like context, but like seeing him do that with his wife at like you know some gathering, it's like oh I can do that at a party, mm-hmm. you know exactly. You got Kenji Kaga hey, wearing a one piece one. You got the pajama collar. Pajama shirts technically have the same yeah. color. Mm. Those are both so cool. I actually hot take. I don't think this is one of Ethan's good looks. This is kind of weird for Ethan. I think it's because his legs are so skinny. Yeah, I mean it's like you know, I like the shirt still. I like the shirt a lot. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and that green shirt I've always wanted. I I really really like this one. Um, that's cool. There's that green shirt there that I is. love. Let's How'd see, you wear <laughs> oh, man. Uh, some more 2017 fits. Whoa! Oh, man. There's me. So... There's Eli. Oh, welcome, Ivan. Whoa, there's me. Damn, yeah. look at it. Go back, go back. Yeah, hover on that one. Then we're gonna send to, let's just get a bigger version of that picture. Hover over it. Yeah. This is how I dressed and in now... high school. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. I got the leather laces on my boots, which I no longer do because they kept breaking. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um. When they look at those well-worn jeans and the yeah. thing, you know. Good jeans, I gotta say. Jeans yeah. are looking cool. Ooh, I don't own that shirt anymore. Cool sweater. That's a good look, though. Yeah, so I mean, I you know. Cool. It's a good sweater. I kind of want another you think one. This shirt's so versatile. There it is. Oh man. There you go, Rob. Spencer. This is, this is an okay Yeah, look. you've been really... Yeah, you wear it. I, I like seeing you wear it with, like, uh... uh I still... I mean, it. you know, it's like, I still like wearing them layered. I'll probably... I, I end up doing it every just, year uh, when it cools just for, down. Just for reference, this is, uh, this is a... This is a rayon. We're talking about rayon, but these are not all rayon. Yeah, MJ owns we're just... One, I mean, we're just talking about... Uh, yeah, we're, we're seeing... We've been seeing a Man, couple what? of cancelled people in the... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's the conclusion? I didn't even update it? Go back down? I don't think you've updated it. Are you going to have to write an update Stop. now? Stop. Go back up. Keep going. I want to see the last outfit in here. Oh, wow. Look. Look at that. Look at that outfit. It's like it's like precursor to current Ethan. I know. <laughs> Wide leg uh, espadrilles wearing the sport shirt. And of course, as you, as you described the caption, you're doing this in the Japanese fashion. <laughs> <laughs> as we know it is. What's, what's above it? Let's see. Okay, well that's like that's pretty. This like, is punk cool. inspired. <laughs> yeah, clearly with the uh, black jeans. Jason, the, is this Jason's not here? But we got to know if this yeah, is punk rock. I know. <laughs> oh wow! Or also early use of the striped tee undershirt. Yeah, too. I remember. Wow, look at this SLT thing! Wow, also the and my hair. That's yelling at me. I gotta open the door. The sleeves. Yeah. yeah. Also, what is with this pose, my man? Like, uh, yeah, you got it. We got it. You got it. Are, are you gonna have to write like a just a paragraph <laughs> to update this yeah. at some point? And edit. Yeah, I'm gonna have to edit like outfits from 2021 and just have just dump it full of like. But what yeah. else did they keep going up? Let's see what else we had the like, SLP look. Okay, that was not bad. I probably wouldn't. That's a good. I mean, that's that's a good shirt. Like that color is really really nice. Yeah, I, I, it was. It's the smallest one I had. It was like a size fourteen. Yeah. So like, was that brown? Yeah, I give. It, yes. Yeah, I had to give it to my ex girlfriend though. Yeah. Uh, wow. Look, at, I still own those pants. Yeah. Have you adjusted because those uh those are a lot slimmer than anything. You would. Um... I think they're the same. I think they're the same. Okay. Yeah, I mean, because I mean, I don't. They were all. They were all. I I I only got them hemmed. I did not taper them. That's a really great so, shirt right there. The uh the yeah. one on the right. That one's really cool. I remember the Yeah, party. dark face alohas. That's a that's, hey, that's this my... is a pretty good look. The I mean, you know, I feel like you you would wear something similar to this today. I I know. I need to get a uh well this has the same ideas of what I wore to the party, right? Yeah. D B uh sport shirt and then a high waisted pant. You I know, mean, yeah, this is also, like, it also helps that this is such a classic, like, 1930s, 1940s outfit. But, of course, it's something, you know, <laughs> you could wear in 2017 or 2021 because it's both equally out of time. Um, yeah, but it still I, looks good. I, I, I need to get, I need to commission, like, a, a brown double-breasted jacket yeah. or suit. Um, so and that yeah, one's, that, the one you're wearing in this photo is really nice with the swelled edges and everything. Beautiful. Yeah, I sold it because yeah. it's a uh, belt back, and I just didn't wear it as much anymore. Hey, I'm doing a Spencer look here with the there you uh, go. with the knitwear, or I guess Tintin kind of also with the color yeah. points peeking out. I still own those pants, baby. I still own them. Good shirt uh, too. You... 
Yep. Yeah. Oh, That's I a great that. shirt. It's it's in my, I, my possession. I <laughs> own that one. Do MJ, do you own these? Uh, oh, maybe I gave these to Andy. These were like my first ever gray high waisted pants. Uh, yeah, I think you gave them to Andy. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, those are pretty high waisted. Oh, I wore something like this recently. Mm. Nice. You know, also, the, I mean, look at like the photography, man. Wow. Damn. This is, uh, mm. and there I am in Paris. Yeah, gay Paris. Gay. Oh, Jay has those pants now. Yeah, he has a full suit, which is that's a great yeah, suit. Like, Super suit. Is that like the most lightweight suit you've ever you ever ever owned? Yeah, vintage wise, yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's like a nineteen sixties unstructured like tropical wool suit. <laughs> that's a great flea that's, market. That's, that's a good flea market outfit. I know. I just can't wear it ever again because I've already worn it. Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, yeah. but no, this is really good. The thing is, though, it's like you can't really wear anything on top. Like, uh, it. It, rayon can stick to you sometimes and that one's particularly like oh yeah actually, that you know, shirt I, yeah I mean, that's because that's um, the pullover that's that, that yeah, that's more delicate awesome. anyway right yeah i need to wear it because it's like i need to i need to do something with it dude, dude. It's, it's so, so cool i know i hey on uh, maybe august 14 i'll wear i'll wear that that uh that thing by the way mj get august 14 off so you can be in the magazine dude i think you're already off on saturdays so yeah I think it'll be yeah. fine. Uh, well, but yeah. Right. But yeah, rayon shirts, guys. I mean, it's so it's so easy. Like, I so mean, easy. even though these looks are dated, I'm not wearing a I don't I'm not wearing a beard. <laughs> I don't have a beard. Actually, none of us have beards in this. Oh. Um and my hair is something else. I look like fucking like it's not even like ABG boy. It's not even like like a like Kevin Wynn hair. It's just like a weird, like kind of vintagey like well, there. This one looks more like a like a Peaky Blinders thing, I guess. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah, because it's more um, uh, it's more brushed than. Yeah, but the like, thing is, my is... hair gets so thick. It just kind of like, it starts out as you guys can see in maybe some other pictures, but like it gets, it can be like a nice comb over, but then as the as it, the day goes on, my hair yeah, expands. Like there, like in that one, it just it just goes out. <laughs> yeah. But now it's... Which is why now it's now it's perfect because like it as i do the middle part whatever like it's it makes the fun like the fun messy hair that i've always wanted but yeah. then when you have like really short sizes comb to one side uh it is uh it doesn't fall right it doesn't fall yeah, it's not it's not good but mm -hmm. like i mean yeah Ray, i mean mg you have some rayon shirts right how do you like yeah. to wear them um i mean prop nothing new you know <laughs> wear it with jeans or with with shorts uh I have like three, three Aloha shirts now. Um, nice. Those are, you know, always fun to wear, especially the black one that I, um, mm -hmm. that I bought from Kiyoshi, because oh, I forgot so if good, he, dude. okay, I forgot already if he, if he bought it and it didn't fit, or he just didn't wear it. That's why he was letting it go. But I think he um, wanted to still, oh, because it's a medium, right? Or small. yeah, um, I think he just wanted a bigger fit. Yeah, probably, but yeah, join the join the Discord, guys. You'll get uh, get those hey. deals. But He'll did you guys uh... early access to these pieces? Mm. Yeah, get the um, deal, man. How, so, how do you guys like? I I know for me, I wear rayon shirts of, of any kind. It doesn't have, again. It doesn't have to be a sports shirt. It can be like a Western shirt or something, uh, which I have a lot of. That I don't think Spencer has a rayon one. You have a silk one though. I have a silk one, but not a rayon Western shirt. Yeah. Yeah, those are fun, um, but I always love them for like going out looks. That that I, that is dedicated how I wear them. Mm -hmm. You know, right. like there's gotta be not an occasion, but like if we're gonna like a bar, um, a party, I guess. You know, because I think my default look, and you can see this like on my Instagram, like I almost always wear a tie. So it's nice to have a piece of clothing that you know is for like going out like hanging out getting a drink going to a party going on a date maybe you know this is like the good like this is a good use of that and rayon is yeah rayon's like the perfect thing do you guys do you guys have any guidelines for how you guys wear them um Spencer? i i guess not really because i mean i treat it like i mean i don't know i just like i uh it's it's like one of those things where i've just been wearing like sport shirts and like you know rayon shirts for so long I just kind of like treat them like any other shirt. Like I said, like you know, I understand, 
Uh, I mean, I yeah, I kind of wear them. Uh, like I guess you know, if I'm going for like the cool factor, I guess because again, um, I don't know if I've you know, it's it's you know, it 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 just work it works with my style. It's yeah. as I said, it's like it's like it's kind of vintage, but it still is kind of like you know, I don't know, like cool or like what like rebellious, whatever you know. Um, yeah, it yeah. still kind of has that kind of energy. Um, yeah. but yeah, I mean, I like I I like the I like the the fabric a lot i want for shirts in that like you know in that rayon but as we as we talked about they're just getting more and more expensive yeah it takes uh it takes the place of polos for me um oh that's a good that's a good way of, of plugging it I yeah think. especially <laughs> how like i don't like wearing jackets or suit or polos with jackets or suits it's just i don't know it's kind of uh, I just it it's just feels, trad. feels it's weird. It's trad and preppy, but yeah, I, I get what you're saying. But yeah, about. I'd, wearing wearing uh wearing a rayon shirt or wearing a camp collar shirt is like to me, it's cooler to wear with a suit than a polo is. Um, right. Polos are for you know chore coats and jungle jackets. <laughs> huh. Yeah, those are. I don't. I don't even wear polo shirts as much anymore. I wouldn't. I know that I've been kind of like an anti, you know, like PK polo shirt mood, but like, I feel like, you know, maybe one day I'll return to it because it's kind of like, you know, French Ivy wearing like the Lacoste polo with like a minimal suit or something. Is, and, and we saw like Style de Papa in our Sad Head Sunday wearing, wearing one, you know, mm-hmm. um, maybe we'll make a return to it, but you know, who knows? The... I, I mean, it's like li- listen, if, right? so, if SJC yeah. starts making the long sleeve plain polos again, I will I will hop back on that train, you know. Yeah. Um, exactly. I want the I want the spear point, I, and you know, like ba- the bamboo cotton that he made his polos uh, in have some yeah. of the the qualities of rayon. They have that nice like kind of vintage heft to it. Natural. The the sponginess. The natural stretch. Yeah, very nice. You know? It's very cool. So um, that's a shout out to the ch- polo shirts that he made like four years ago. But I really really hope he starts making. Well, how again. about 